So anyway, I bought this years ago, and I'm going to try using this to pull the data off of that hard drive. So first of all, we got to open her up, pull everything out of here. All right, so the parts that come with this are number one, this is your transformer, and this is where you hook up the power cable. All right, so you get two of these, all right? Let me show you. There's two of them. So you've got to check and see which one of these is going to work with your computer. You follow me? Or your hard drive. So you got to look at the pins and see how many, you know, if, if you've got the right one, okay? So once you figure that out, then you can put it, you know, slide it in. Now, if you look at this, this one has this little thing on it and this one, you know, they're a little bit different. So you're going to have to check your hard drive and see which ones that you're going to use. Now, once you figure out which one you're going to use, like let's say this one, then you're going to see that there's this little plug thing and you just got to mush it in there. If you notice, this is curved. So this, those are the contacts that just goes like this. So now this is your power to your hard drive. There's your transformer. For you to get this powered up, you got to use this cord, right? All right, so there's your cord, and the cord is going to slip right inside there like this, okay? You want to get it all the way in. Once you've done that, now you've got um, it ready to be plugged into the thing, and then you can stick it on your hard drive. You follow me? Right there, all right, just like that. So let's set that down for a second. All right, so this thing here, all right, is what you're going to connect to your um, computer. So you get a USB-A, which is the old style USB. And then this here, you'll notice it has a bunch of pins on either side of this, but you're not going to use that for, for the hard drive that we're going to be looking at. We're going to be using something like this. Now you get two of these. I think you get two of them. I thought I had two. But anyway, this, if you look, you're going to see how many, there's some pins in there. All right, so that's got to go into the computer. The other end of this, you're going to see here, and it's got a little crook on it, right? So what you've got to do is you've got to figure out where that crook is. You see that little thing popping down? So I've got to match that up, and when I do, then I just push it on like that. Now this is ready to go. Now this is going to plug into your hard drive. This is going to plug into the computer, all right? You follow me? So let's set that down over here, all right? All right, so I want to show you a little bit closer shot of this. So here it is. You see that little channel there? So that has to go on that spot right there. And so I'm going to turn it like this. I'm going to push this right on there. You see that? It should go on, but it's not, it doesn't want to. There we go. All right, so now that's on. So that is the power, right? All right, this one here, you see there's the little thing. I gotta twist it this way, right? To get that on there. So I'm just gonna push it right on. And now we've got these two on there ready to go. Okay, this here, again, just so you can see, it slides right on there just like the, the other thing. Got to get it right in there and smash it. And that's ready to go now. Now all we got to do is plug it in. Power goes in here, data comes out here. Okay, power here, data comes out here, flows through this into the computer. All right, so we got to get this in there, right? It's USB. So I'm just going to put it right in. No, that's not going to work. All right, let's flip it around. You just got to figure out how to get it in there. Make sure you get it plugged in good. Now we're ready to go. Now we can go ahead and plug in the uh, uh, the power supply. Mm. So here we are. Just going to plug it in here. So we got it plugged in there. We got a green light. Should be reading it. We'll find out in a second, right? Cross your fingers. Okay, let me close everything out. All right, so we're looking for this to show up. It's making some noises. You hear it clicking? It's 
trying to. And this is a, all right, it should show up on the desktop. Bam, there it is. It just popped up. So this is working. And now all we got to do is open that up and drag all the information off of that onto this computer. And I won't bore you with that. But yeah, that's it. I'm just going to take my cursor, bring it over here, set it on there, and click it. And bam, there it is. Bob is my uncle. We're in. All right, so anyway, let's take a look and see what we got. Look, here's all the applications for that hard drive. See all this? It's showing everything that's on it. All the way down. Let's look at the library. There they are. Everything's there. Look at that. Here's our systems. Here's our library for systems. Everything is there. <laughs> Users. All right, look at that. Movies. Music. Pictures. It's taking a while for it to... That's guess, so I don't think we're going to get anything out of that. But let's go to here. Let's go to Tom Lehman. See what we get. Oh, shit, look at all that. All right, so now I could go into pictures for me. And I could go to iPhoto Library, which is 160 gigabytes of photos. It's kind of what I want to get. I want to pull that off and put it in uh, in one of these hard drives over here. But yeah, that's it, man. We did it. All right. All right if you like this video, subscribe to my channel and check out my other awesome videos where I do stuff like that. Peace out.